today so as you can see I've got my multimeter here pulled apart um, I made a small mistake <laughs> um, I'm working on this AC voltage multiplier circuit for projects I'm working on and I, let, I was measuring current previously and I've forgotten I'd done that and I stuck the probes across the mains and pop chip the RCD and all sorts of stuff so um, <laughs> anyway the fuse on the back didn't blow um, but the internal fuse did so I've had to pull it apart and get the fuse out and this is the original fuse here let's get some more light actually and see it better right, so this is the original fuse pop a you know, decent quality one now the only thing I've got is this so um, and it's actually this is a 20 amp fuse which is actually a bit big the, internal, the original one is a um, a 12 amp fuse the one on the back is a 10 amp fuse so obviously this is a fast blow the one on the back must be a slow blow and so the internal one blew first <laughs> obviously that's only supposed to go if something major happens you know but um, it's happened now it's got this little plastic cover over the top as well to obviously explosion protection thing so this one here is not actually the right one for the job but that's all I've got for the time being I'm going to have to get some of these um, and I'll replace that later on so if you you know want to see what's inside it now I've got the thing apart you can actually have a look alright so there you go so that's where the fuse is to stand there and um, yeah a bit of an oopsie on that one so, but yeah so I thought I'd just show you the inside and show you that hey I make mistakes sometimes <laughs> And uh, a classic one is obviously sticking current probes across a voltage supply. Not the best thing, but um, it doesn't appear to have done any damage anywhere. Not I can see anyway. The only thing that seems to be gone is that fuse. So I'll find out when I actually got to um, power it back up again and try it out. So I'm going to put that fuse in. We, we put it all back together again, and um, fingers crossed it will work. Um, but who knows it may not um, yeah dumb thing to do very dumb but it amazes me that the fuse on the back didn't blow first you know it's showing it's actually I'll get it out for you actually, I'll show you it's got signs of starting to go I think it's lighting it well enough maybe you can see it I don't know but um, on focus well you can see it's starting to go alright you can see it's got signs of it it's obviously weakened but it's still intact it hasn't actually gone so um, yeah it, you know that almost went first but when you're going across the mains that's a bit of a surge current there so it's not surprising but yeah it's a stupid mistake to make but uh, anyway so watch out for that catch you later